Hello internet, welcome to the Doing Ideas channel. Today you are going to learn about watches in Vue.js. Imagine that you want to listen to a particular data, listen, watch a particular data element and do something with it. For example, we can be an Ajax request. You can do that with a watcher. So let's look at how we can define a watch. So first they have this special keyword watch. And then we should mention what is the data that we want to watch. So in this case, we want to watch the age data. So to tell that, we have to name the function the same name. So here age, here age. This function gets two parameters, the new value and the old value. So uh, let's console log those two and see. New is new and old is old all right Ooh. we shouldn't use new as a variable let's use new value new value and let's take a look at it we have let's type in one so the new value is two the old value is empty string when i hit three the new value is 23 and the old value is two all right so now you know how a watch works. We can watch a data. We can also watch a, com watch a computer property as well. So if we have, uh, let's say, age times two. <laughs> let's do age multiplied. This is our computed property. Let's have that. Computed. And we can define our computed property, age multiplied. Age multiplied is this dot age. Okay, and we can see it working. Yeah, it's time to stool. All right, so then we can create a watch for that as well. Age multiplied. And here we can do what we want. We can say alert uh, something, but this also gets the new and the old values. So I'll do new value and we'll see what we get. Okay, let's refresh. And when I type in two here, the old value, new value, I get four because we did alert the new value and the age multiplied returns this age times two which is four right so now you know how to write watches in Vue.js and when to use them please do like share my tutorials and stay tuned for the next one and have a good day bye